Shit. So 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 sometimes. so so really at the end of the then don't be with them like that's that's what I'm saying because we talking about like what happens after you cheat and my thing about women is this like the same shit that you getting annoyed about I get annoyed about because the thing with women is if you want to be with the person just be with her I'm not saying forgive forget whatever this and that like because the world don't work like that typically we work off of a, a tally system sometimes you know. This person, this person did something, and now this person do something. Then you doing a tit for tat type of scenario. Mm -hmm. That's typically the world that we that we working in. But my thing is like, why go down this, this down this rabbit hole? This, and this is rhetorical. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Why go down this rabbit hole? Because I don't even make no decisions. When we first started doing this show, I used to get penalized a lot for saying like, "Hey, bitch, cheat on me, I'm out." People be like, "Why? Why?" Why is because at the end of the day, I'm not inch high private eye. I'm not magnum PI. I don't want to go down this list of trying to figure out a whole bunch of shit. If I'm sitting in the room with this girl and she done cheated, I can ask every question that I need to be. Because there's going to be certain points that I just need. To, I can put everything else together. But I don't but think it, you're tallying I'll let small you talk. I, I don't need to tally the small shit because there's only one big thing that happened that I give a fuck about. And that big thing is you fucked someone else. So now it comes to the decision on whether I'm staying or going. And this is what the problem is with women. It's like, you fucking need time to decide whether you fucking want to stay or go. Someone already proved to you what the fuck they are. It's like, this right goddamn death. But no, y'all want to do like idiotic dumb shit. Like give ultimatums and all this other shit. That's just really what it boiled down to. Like, I don't need you... I don't need you to sit there and, and, and ask me a bunch of questions now about like where I'm going and stuff. Because you know why? You ain't finna do that to your new dude. So go get the new dude. You don't need to fucking do that to me. It's either you forgive me or don't. I'm, give, I'm a giving you the opportunity to ask me all the questions and get everything out on the table that needs to be put out on the table. But we ain't in no fucking court for no fucking year for you to cross-examine me about every fucking little thing that fucking came up. I ain't do that to the girl that cheated on me. I just need to know the what, when, why. That's it. Okay, but so you are at least saying out loud that you don't care about the other things. You know why I care about the other things? Because you're a woman. Be no, it, yes, that too. But you can see the character of a person not really from a mistake that they made. But all the preparation they do to make that fucking mistake. I get men could be out somewhere be intoxicated. There are a lot of reasons, different reasons why people are in a situation where they end up cheating. Mm -hmm. I, I can understand that. To be honest with you, I can have a conversation with my guy about that and probably be very understanding, very sympathetic, and very forgiving because a man is a man. What shows me his character, though, is how many times he looked in my motherfucking face and t fucking told a lie. That is what burns my motherfucking biscuits because I am a loving person. So I'm all I'm trying to do is love you and cook for you and clean up and play with the dog and have a wholesome. I'm talking about me personally, okay. have a wholesome situation. And so I can't imagine someone looking me in my face and lying to me to get out the fucking door to go fuck somebody else. Gotcha. That's why I'm hell bent. Gotcha. Now, this is the thing. Now, we're going to take it from your perspective. The thing about that is like. And this is just some things that I feel like women don't get sometimes. Those words that you just said, I'm loving, caring, and just trying to show you. Really, do you really think, like, if a man cheated on you, that he gives a fuck about any of that shit? Like, I, if, if I'm just being, like, realistically, like, does he really give a fuck about all this he loving? He doesn't, but he exactly. So, we ain't talking about what we should, because a lot, I, like, as a man, I'd be like, Men should have extra pussy in the house. We should. You know what I'm saying? It don't go like that for everybody. But, but you know, it should. So we ain't talking about if if was a fifth, we'd all be drunk. You know what I'm saying? We talking about the now. <laughs> so with that being said, what I'm saying. <laughs> if what? If if was a fifth, we'd all be drunk. <laughs> I'm not talking about I'm trying not to bust out laughing so bad, but this fucking I'll interrupt you. <laughs> that was all oh, 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 yeah. yeah. If what? If if was a fifth, we'd all be drunk. I can't <laughs> 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 that's, that's just real deal. But for real, if was a fifth, we'd all be drunk. 
So really at the end of the day, what I'm saying is like, if I'm not saying the man should run from the questions that you, that you, you know, you want to give. Y'all conversation that y'all deserve mm -hmm. about the fuck up that he did. Mm -hmm. But what I'm saying is to hold it over his head is the issue that I really have. Because now you're not doing anything to that relationship but making it more toxic. And trust has to be won back. It has to be earned. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I'm a firm believer of that. But it also has to be a cutoff date. Like if it's, if it's to the point where you just feel like you don't trust me. We need to go ahead and just, we need to wipe tides and this and that. Like, it ain't no sense to be going through all that. And on top of that, it's a woman. You shouldn't want to go through that. Like, I don't want to wake up day in and day out. Wonder where she going. Did she really go to work? Are they really where they say they are? Like, it's a lot of energy that go into that shit. Checking phones. Breaking in the emails. Like, this shit, like, this shit is crazy. Like, the type of shit women will go through. And I'm just like... You want to jump all them hurdles to find out your man shit ain't shit for some shit you already know. He already proved that shit to you. So it's up to you now to say, he ain't shit, I need to just go ahead. But you want to waste time, three, four years, holding shit over his head, nagging him for all this type of time. You could be in a whole new relationship, but you want to ride this shit out that fucking far. It don't take all that. If you want to move on, move the fuck on. You know what I'm saying? Like, why are you beating the shit into the dirt? Well, you know, I really don't believe in women beating things in the dirt after they have already said, okay, I forgive you. But I don't want to blur the line between holding something over your head and a year later, you're <clears throat> sitting down having a conversation and you just say, by the way, I just, you know, I just want to ask a question. You know, and you, I, me and my, my relationship is like that. It doesn't matter. We could talk about anything and if the conversation is gets heated it still comes to a place where we know we're just having a conversation it's not the end of the relationship we're just talking if the relationship isn't like that yes you could be in trouble when it comes to bringing things back up because to the man it's gonna feel like yes she's holding it over my head it's not that you mm -hmm. ought to understand mm -hmm. one you said the magic word you have to earn back trust mm -hmm. imagine cheating on somebody and in the middle of you earning your trust You've done something to trigger the person, whether it's coming mm -hmm. home late mm -hmm. or she see a text from a person that you said you wasn't involved with or talking to anymore. Mm -hmm. That'd be the shit. Mm -hmm. Man, I ain't talked to this girl in about six months. It's mm -hmm. been a year. You said that last week. Motherfucker, go through your phone just to get to Google and see this bitch been calling you three weeks straight. Every morning, 6 a.m., she's sending you I love you and a kiss. Mm -hmm. But you haven't talked to her or spoke with her mm -hmm. or heard from her in six months. These are the mm -hmm. things that make your woman question your gotcha. character and that just makes her you know sneaky what? but 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 i want to i do want to say this you know because we talked about variables okay mm -hmm. a lot of times and i've watched this this scenario this scenario which you're talking about play out a lot of times mm -hmm. a lot of times this is what the man does the man the fucked up he like you know what i'm gonna be good i even talk to my homeboys sometimes and they be like you know what spade i've been good all this time you know what i'm saying and why you on that good path here come the curveball. But it come at the time where this, your lady asked you, had you talked to this motherfucker? And you hadn't talked to him. You just never, and it's like, because it's, it's and I'm not sure if it happened to women, but it happened to men. When you're on a good street, when you're in a real good street, you haven't been fucking up, it's like the temptation just come out of nowhere. You know what I'm saying? Like, you haven't been fucking nobody. You ain't been, you even tell your homeboys, man, I ain't even been fucking nobody. I've been good. And then all of a sudden, it's like, bitches know you happy. And they don't want you to be happy. So they start calling. Then you tell them, look, man, stop calling me. You know what I'm saying? I'm good. I'm straight. And they just won't. 